Okay, this is Michael Adams for Stock Telegraph and CEO Roaster, and I'm still at the Vancouver Resource Investment Conference 2018 in Vancouver, of course. And yeah, it's a new company I'm talking to uh, today, and um, it's it's Palamina Corporation trading on the TSX Venture as PA. And joining me is Andrew Thompson. He's president and CEO of the company. So um, yeah, and let's see what the company is all about. So thanks for taking the time to talk to me, and maybe in a nutshell, yeah, give us kind of the the big picture on the company. So Palomino was a spin-out. We sold our last company to Agnico. Okay. We've gone into southeastern Peru looking for organic gold deposits. Uh, we've staked roughly 70 different uh, areas within, there's six main areas but 60 pieces of ground. Uh, we're just starting to see title on them and uh, effectively we're trying to get a very big position in the belt, something that would appeal to the major companies looking for, and we're trying to fulfill the need of all the major gold companies right now. Okay, so right now you're in the development stage, or is it still exploration? So how would you uh, describe it? We're really in acquisition stage. Uh, most of the projects are grassroots. Okay. Uh, it's in a proven belt. Uh, this particular belt had very little infrastructure. There's a lot of new roads that have gone in. And what we're seeing is they all have access now. Okay. And so a lot of these things have been ground truth by informal miners where they're mining down 50 to 100 meters. We believe you know, with the orogenic belt that it go down, you know, uh, you know, kilometers. So okay. really where it gets exciting, it's not been drilled. So these are the sorts of things that appeal to us. Uh, the major, at Rinconada, for example, there's 30,000 informal workers. So there's this uh, gold rush going on at the base of the mountain range. There's 650 square kilometers of uh, jungle that's disappeared where they're okay. mining. So all, all the gold in these areas, we think, comes from this orogenic area so there's further up there's Pataz which we believe I'm told is about 44 million ounces this area of infrastructure is opening up and so that's where our projects are and that's what we're chasing okay cool and you um, told us about the um, history of the company so when did that happen since when is the company around the company's about two and a half years old okay. um, we have done one financing uh, the ground was primarily the cards she's taking but the big thing really is uh, we're in Peru where there was a company called Monero IRL and that team defined a four million ounce deposit in this belt okay. and they have 27 years experience so the first acquisition was that team so in my opinion we've shortened our null you know we've got a the knowledge that we acquired there was probably the most important and then uh, Peru went through a bit of a downturn like everybody and a lot of ground that has not been open for a very long period of time came open and we staked it. So our acquisition cost is very low. So in a time when the uh, US dollar versus the Canadian dollar is quite high where it's quite expensive to go drilling, we've chosen to do more acquisition to try and grab it, you know, basically an entire orogenic belt. So um, yeah, you already mentioned the importance of, of people, so can you give us the background of yourself and a little bit about the rest of the team? So previously I had a company called Soltoro as the president of that company. Uh, we defined a very significant silver asset in Mexico. We sold that company to Agnico. Uh, Don MacGyver, who's my chief geologist, was the chief geologist for a company called Minera IRL in the Puno Belt. And uh, I hired him, his second in command, and some of that team, quite a few from that team. And so we've saved a lot of time in that they have 27 years experience in the belt. And so that's really the team. In terms of the board of directors, uh, everybody has development experience. We're actually all quite young, you know, so there's a, a very uh, profound board that have added a lot of market cap. Uh, in terms of the people, there's Hugh Agar, who is VP of Kinross. I, on my advisory board, I have Jose Vizqueda Benavides, who's, uh, you know, his grandfather started Buenaventura, so that gives us some depth in, in Peru, Buenaventura being one of the largest Peruvian companies, mining companies. Uh, Alistair Waddell, he was uh, Greenfields for Kinross. Uh, Darren Wagner, who's here, he sold his last company to Lakeshore, he runs Balmoral, but we're all proven in the sense that we've, we've had uh, some real success, and so, um, this market is a bit sharpshooter, you know, in terms of raising funding, and so uh, we're lucky in that uh, we can make these steps and move forward and, and do things that more aggressively perhaps than others, and so we've been very aggressive in picking up a significant position. So we have six major gold land positions. We've got visible gold on the properties. Uh, you know, it's really quite significant, and again, not, not, none of it's been drilled, and uh, it's been ground truth by the informals miners to maybe 50 to 100 meters. Okay, good. Yeah, and let's, let's take a look at 2018. So what are the plans for the company? What are the next steps? What are the catalysts, the milestones you hope to achieve? So in other words, what kind 
kind of news flow can the investor expect? So we have several acquisitions we're working on. Uh, I can say that we're completing one as we speak. Uh, that will reinforce our base. Uh, we do plan on trying to get some drilling done. It's a permitting issue at this stage. Okay. Um, we have some very good targets. One very, two that are very similar to Oyachea, one that I think we'll probably uh, see some drilling this year. Um, we're adjacent to uh, some fairly significant gold deposits. Okay. So from that perspective, uh, we're in the right area with the right people at the right time. Uh, I happen to believe that Peru is under drilled and that this particular belt is uh, quite significant. Okay. Good. So for now, thank you very much. I think that was a really good first introduction. Um, I urge my viewers to take a look at the website of the company, which is? Uh, www.palamina.com. P-A-L-A-M-I-N-A.com. And I will link that somewhere around this video. So for now, thank you very much. Thank you.